welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to do a little bit of an updated makeup video. I know I've done makeup videos in the past, but I figured that I've got new makeup, a new style that I want to show you guys, so why not just show you guys my new routine. And I am actually going to do a drugstore makeup tutorial. So this is all stuff that you can buy at a drugstore, Walmart, Target, any drugstore near you. If not, you can probably order it online. I am going to jump into this and I will also show you stuff as I'm putting it on. So let's just jump into this. So the very first thing that I'm going to do is I'm actually going to throw some primer slash lotion on my face. And honestly, this stuff helps out a lot. It kind of just sets the foundation and concealer and whatever you're going to put on. Sets it in there nice and makes it look moisturized and not fall into your cracks of your face and kind of um, smudge and crack and look funny. And then next thing, number two, I'm going to put on some eyebrows. And honestly, eyebrows are my focal point. If I didn't have eyebrows, I look like a bum. I I can go without eyelashes, I can go without eye makeup, but I need my eyebrows. <laughs> and if you guys have seen before on my eyebrow video, I have a specific trick that I use and I've always used it. Well, recently since I've started doing actual makeup and not just slapping on some eyeliner and some mascara. But this trick really works for me and it seems to, you know, make my eyebrows look perfect. that after I do my little trick and after I make the gradient I'm actually going to go in and conceal my whole eyebrow. I know some people only do bottom or only do top but I do the whole thing. I just kind of want to give it that shape that I really love and that point on the end and the nice gradient right there. And also when I'm going in with that concealer I just kind of bring it down onto my eyelid so that I can kind of have that primer concealer for, you know, the eyeshadow to make the eyeshadow stick more and be more vibrant. And today's colors I actually chose were like a light gray, black, and gold. This gold that I have in this nude palette is just beautiful. It is so pretty, it just sparkles. And I just adore it. I think it just looks so great and especially with my green eyes, it just kind of fits. And next, after that, I'm actually just going to throw on some eyelashes. I am not going to attempt to do eyeliner today. Lately I have been crap at eyeliner. <laughs> so I just skip it all together and actually I do have this amazing eyelash glue that's got blueberry in it, like blueberry and biotin and it's just so cool and actually it's black. So the black kind of makes it look like I'm wearing eyeliner just without the wing. Alright, now I'm going to go in and fix my face. I am going to put on foundation because as you guys can see before, it was all red and, you know, splotchy and I did have a little bit of acne in my chin. So let's just get rid of that. on all my foundation and it's blended beautifully I am gonna go in with some concealer and your girl needs some concealer I don't know what it's been with me lately I just don't get the best of sleep so I have terrible bags under my eyes and they are blue and purple and it's terrible and then next thing I'm going to do I'm actually going to do it right now so that I can put baking powder on. I am going to contour and I'm actually going to use the cool, beautiful new Moda brushes that I just got and that I absolutely love. Not only because of their color but because of how great they blend and how great of a gradient they give you and it's not a harsh line. It's very pretty and it's very non 
subtle. <laughs> so then after contour, I'm actually going to take my cheapo baking powder from e.l.f. and I am just going to put that under my eyes, on my nose, on my forehead, side of face just to give it more of that sculpture thin look that I'm looking for. And now after I've let that sit for a minute, I'm going to go in and just brush some of it off so I can get some highlighter on. You guys know that's my favorite. <laughs> and I'm actually today wearing the Wet n Wild Rose Gold highlighting powder. Alright, so next I am just going to put on this very, very pretty NYX lingerie. Lingerie? Lingerie? I'm just going to say NYX because I am not going to be embarrassed because I said it terribly wrong. Um, in the color Corset and it is matte and then last but not least some setting spray and just you know coat your face really good and your makeup will stay all day my new updated makeup video and if you guys liked it give it a thumbs up comments feel free to comment below and we will reply or I will reply if it is beauty related and we will see you guys later bye guys